Airbus getting much of the buzz here at the China Aviation Expo as China's Southern Airlines announces it will take delivery of the first of five wide-body super jumbos next month. First going to fly it domestically and then internationally competing directly against the likes of Cathay Pacific and Singapore Airlines for the Trans-Pacific flights. Airbus says it hopes that will be the first of many deliveries to the mainland market. Well, I think it puts uh, China Southern right up there in the, in the first league of international airlines, and that's something, of course, that's very important for Chinese airlines. Uh, it, traditionally, they haven't uh, had, I uh, would say, a fair share of the international traffic. As for Boeing, earlier this month, it increased its outlook for the China aviation market, saying it's going to need 5,000 new aircraft over the next 20 years, and this is the lineup it is banking on. This is the new 737 MAX, the re-engined, more fuel-efficient aircraft that will compete directly against the A320 NAO. Next is the Dreamliner with its signature raked wings, all composite frame. Chinese airlines, including China Southern, have ordered this. China Southern has 10 of these Dreamliners on order. Next is the replacement for the aging 747, the 747-8 Intercontinental, the direct competitor to the Super Jumbo A380 from Airbus. We think that the, uh, the, the Intercontinental, fantastic plane, absolutely right for the marketplace. China, globally. You have to have a jumbo airplane. You don't need a jumbo airplane, but you have to have a jumbo airplane. This is the new kid on the tarmac, the domestically made Comac C919, China's answer to Boeing and Airbus's single aisle jet. The airplane maker says it already has more than 100 orders from China's domestic airlines, and Boeing says, bring it on. We welcome competition. Competition drives us to build better airplanes. Competition drives everybody to innovate and stay on the leading edge of innovation. Competition gives better choices to airline customers, and uh, so it makes us all sharpen our pencils. A Comac official just told me off camera that the market is big enough for all players. It's sure to shape up to be a very competitive airspace over China for years to come. Stephen Engel, Bloomberg News, Beijing.